every... one. Fear not, Princess of Dalmasca. We, Ocuria, have chosen you. And you alone. and Dalmasca, we see your heart desires power, and power most holy shall we grant. Seek you the sun crest, slumbering star. In tower on distant shore, it dreams. The mother of all Nethysite, the source of its unending power. The Dynast King, his fellow shards, coarse trinkets cut from sun crest's light. Such power exists? In times that are long passed away, we sought to save this Ivalice, and chose Wraithwall, the Dynast King. He took the sword and cut the crest. Three shards he took from its gilt grasp, and so became the Dynast King. His words and deeds run through your veins. That's why I was given it, the Sword of Kings. The treaty held with kings of old is but a memory, cold and still. With you, we now shall treat anew, to cut a run for history's flow. Now take this sword, this treaty blade, a curian seal, mark of your worth. Cut deep the crest, and seize your shards. Wield Dynas King's power. Destroy Vanar. But Vanar? Vanar's an Acurian, a being like you. Vanar is a heretic! Uh. The Nethysite is ours to give to chosen bearer, or to none. The heretic trespassed and set the rose of knowledge in man's hand. With imitations they profane. It is anathema to us. We give you now the stone and task. Administer judgment. Destroy them all. Judgment? <sighs> Destroy them all? The Empire? The hues of a skew. Histories weave. With haste, they move through two short lives. Driven to air by base desires. Toward waste and wasting. On they run. Undying, we are curious like the path for wayward sons of man. Oft did we pass judgment on them, so that Ivalice might endure. Eternal, we are history's stewards, to set the course and keep it true. The Chosen is our hand, our fist, to let live some and crush the rest. Princess, you have been chosen. Take revenge against those who stole your kingdom. Fulfill your role as savior. Attain to your birthright. What's with these Acuria? What gives them the right to tell you what to do? Will you take revenge, as they ask? Huh? We could not see them, but we heard the Acuria speak. They may be gods, but we are the arbiters of our destiny. Your Highness, I am against this. The Empire must pay, but destruction... 
Um... Does anyone know what happened to Dr. Sid? Wasn't he saying he'd be here? He should have arrived by now. And I should have realized by now. He's not coming. He laid out the bait and we bit. Remember what he said? He wanted Ash to get the stone. He wanted that all along. That's why he flaunted his nethersite and reeled us in with his stories about Gitter Vagan, all to bring Ash to the Arcuria. But wait, if we got a hold of the nethersite, wouldn't that be bad for the Empire? Maybe he wants to see what happens when foes with nethersite collide. That'd be just like Dr. Sid. I will search out the Sun Christ. History is built by our hands. That's his favorite line. He'd never stand by and watch the Acurious Stones shape things. So, he was talking to Venar all along. He wasn't mad at all then, was he?